Hello dear students, our today's topic is the local anesthetic agents and in this lecture we will go for the individual drugs which are included in syllabus of Pharmacy Council of India. So let's look at the first class that is the benzoic acid derivatives. The drug belonging to this category, the first drug is cocaine which have this structure. If we look at the structure carefully, we will find the presence of bicyclic ring system. In this ring, you can find the fusion of two rings. One is this ring, a five-membered one, and one is this one, which is a six-membered ring. Collectively, this ring is called as tropane. And for this ring system, the numbering is given here, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Here, the numbering start with the bridged atoms, the atoms which are common to both the rings. So this will be the number 1 and this will be number 2. So with this numbering, the IUPC name of this compound is as it is given over here. If we look more closely, we will find cocaine being the ester. It is the ester because it consists of this group COO and here also a COO. So it is the ester. This bicyclic ring system contains eight atoms. So we will call it octane and it is attached with its position number 2 so we will call it octane to il carboxylate and it is derivative of methyl ester so we will write the name methyl over here so in simple word without the substituents we will call it methyl octane to il carboxylate methyl octane to il carboxylate now on position number three we have the presence of this group which is called as benzoyl attached with oxygen so it will become benzyloxy on position number eight there is a methyl group so it is eight methyl the eighth position is acquired by a nitrogen so we will write over here eight aja and as I said that it is a bicyclic ring system. So we will use the prefix bicyclo octane. So between bicyclo and between octane we have a square bracket which consists of some numbers 3, 2 and 1. So what these numbers are? These bridged atoms are having the distance of three atoms one two and three which is the longest distance both these bridged atom have a two carbon distance over here and here so it is two and both of these bridged atoms are separated by this single atom that is only with nitrogen so it is one so whenever we are going to write down the IUPC name of fused ring system we have to write down the distance between the bridged atoms by the longest root by the intermediate root and by the shortest root so that's why the IUPC name of cocaine is this one this cocaine is obtained from the leaves of the plant erythrozylon coca and though it consists of nitrogen this compound belongs to the category of alkaloids and it is also synthesized by many researchers in the laboratory and its synthesis is starts with igonin or the derivatives of igonin so dear students you can find a question in the GPAT examination that the cocaine was first synthesized from 
and four options will be given. So you have to identify that it is egonin from where the cocaine is synthesized. And please keep this point in mind. This is the first local anesthetic agent to be discovered and used. This drug is employed topically in one or two percent solution for anesthesia of earth, nose, throat, rectum and vagina. It, this drug is not used systemically because cocaine is found to cause addiction. So that's why it is not used systemically, rather it is employed topically in one or two percent solution. If we look at more closely in the structures, we find the presence of this benzoyl oxy group along with this bicyclic ring. Here the ring is of 6 carbon and another ring is of 5 carbons. So when the researchers modified the structure, they found that it is the benzoyl oxy group attached with some 2 carbon or 3 carbon spacing or a 6 member drink which is ultimately required to produce local anesthetic activity. So with this there evolve the formation of next drug which is called as hexyl cane. If we look we find that here is only the presence of this benzoyl oxy group attached with a 2 carbon spacer a nitrogen and a cyclohexyl group. So though it consists of a cyclohexyl group, it is called as hexyl cane. This drug is a short acting local anesthetic agent, but it is not used to that much frequency. The next drug is piperocaine. Once again, it consists of a benzoyl oxy group attached with a three carbon space and a six membered heterocyclic ring in this case it is a piperidine ring attached with a methyl group at portion number two this drug is used as its hydrochloride salt form for infiltration and nerve block anesthesia but this drug also is not used to that much intensity though many potent drugs are evolved into the market. The next drug is Meprylcane. As the name indicates, this Meprylcane means the presence of Me means methyl and Pr means propyl group. So methyl, propyl and this propyl amino makes this ring or this compound as Meprylcane. This drug is a local anesthetic with a stimulant property. This causes the constriction of the blood vessels. The next drug is cyclomethicane. If we look at the structure of cyclomethicane and piprocaine, we find the structural similarity over here. Both of these drugs have this structural similarity. The only difference is the cyclohexyl oxy group is attached on the benzene ring at the para position. So this group is present in cyclomethicane and in piprocaine it is upset. So cyclomethicane is a rarely used local anesthetic agents. So next category is the lidocaine and the anilide derivatives which is the most important category of local anesthetic agents. The first compound belonging to this category is lidocaine itself which is also called as lignocaine and xylocaine. In market you can find the xylocaine jelly which consists of this structure. If we go for the IUPC nomenclature of this compound, we have to select the long carbon chain along with the functional group. So here the long carbon chain is of two carbon. This is carbon number one and this is carbon number two. And the functional moiety is CONH. That means it is amide. And with a two carbon chain, it will become acetamide. 
तो दिस इज कार्बन नंबर वन एंड कार्बन नंबर टू एंड दिस इज द नाइट्रोजन ऑफ द अमाइड ऑन पोजिशन नंबर टू वे हैव दिस डाई इथाइल अमाइनो ग्रुप एंड ऑन नाइट्रोजन वे हैव दिस टू सिक्स डाई मिथाइल फिनाइल ग्रुप सो टू डाई इथाइल अमाइनो एंड टू सिक्स डाई मिथाइल फिनाइल एस्टामाइड विल बी द आई यू पी सी नेम ऑफ लीडोके Now this is the most widely used local anesthetic agent and it has some anti arrhythmic property also so for the therapy of arrhythmia lidocaine can also be used a good combination of lidocaine is with epinephrine lidocaine is a local anesthetic agent and epinephrine cause the vasoconstriction so the combined effect gives the prolonged action of local anesthesia this drug has a rapid onset and longer duration of action and it is the most widely used local anesthetic one now this drug is employed for field block and infiltration anesthesia if we look at the metabolic product of lidocaine this compound undergoes dealkylation first that is removal of one of the ethyl group so when one of the ethyl group is removed out from here we have monoethyl glycine xylenylide as one of the major metabolite when both of the ethyl groups are removed out from here through dealkylation we have glycine xylenide as the second metabolite so dear students you can find this question in gpat examination also that identify the important metabolite of lidocaine so in this case you have to identify that it is either monoethyl glycine xylenide or glycine xylenide which are the most important metabolites of lidocaine now the next drug is etidocaine this drug also has the structural similarity with lidocaine in etidocaine this et here stands for this ethyl group over here and on nitrogen we have the ethyl and the propyl substituent so here for iupc nomenclature we will select this long carbon chain so which consists of four carbons 1 2 3 and 4 so it is derivative of butena mite on nitrogen again we have 2 6 methyl phenyl group and on this second carbon we have presence of ethyl propyl amino group so collectively the name will be n26 dimethyl phenyl 2 ethyl propyl amino butenamide now this drug has the rapid onset of action that is about 3 to 5 minutes and it has the prolonged duration of action that is about 5 to 10 hours that means during this period of time in between 5 to 10 hours any local surgery can be carried out this drug should not have to be used for spinal anesthesia now this one the next drug is mepivacaine and prilocaine this mepivacaine and prilocaine both are the anilide derivatives and are structurally related with the lidocaine this mepivacaine stands for the presence of methyl piperidine moiety along with the lidocaine portion and in prilocaine this pr stands for the propyl amino group attached with a three carbon chain so for the ipc name of mepivacaine we write down n26 dimethyl phenyl 2 piperidine 2 il 1 methyl il and the name of the basic moiety acetamide for prilocaine our iupc name will be n 2 methyl il phenyl 2 propyl amino propenamide or it is simply called as alaninamide because it is structurally related with alanine the mepivacaine is employed for the nerve block anesthesia 
while the prelocane is employed for nerve block for dental procedures so dear students that is all about the two categories of drug that is the benzoic acid derivatives and the analyte derivatives which are included in your syllabus so thanks for watching the video please like share and subscribe thank you